I am chumming the waters up. You can see the snooker just jumping in there eating the chum. Throwing little handfuls of freebies out there. And they are fired up and basically biting on every cast. This is what live bait chumming is all about. Well, actually, that's what live bait chumming is all about. <laughs> yeah. A nice fish from Miss Bonnie. Beautiful snook. Got a big redfish on while we're snook fishing. Yeah, this is awesome. Oh, didn't expect that. Oh, I was like, this does not feel like a snook. Oh, so beautiful, beautiful red. Nice redfish for Miss Bonnie. We're out here snook fishing. This was an unexpected catch. Yeah, go ahead and let her yeah. get her back in. Okay. okay, red. Another little bit better snook on here, I think. Oh yeah, decent one. Oh yeah. You don't have to do that when they're when they're close to the boat, just when they're heading for the structure. Nice. That's what we're out here looking for. Nice pretty girl with a nice pretty snook. Beautiful day in Sarasota in mid-October, even though it's like high in the upper 80s, 90s. Upper 80s, almost 90. Yeah. But anyway, come to Florida to catch one of these guys. All right, Ken's got another one. This time I think it's a pretty nice speckled trout. Oh yeah, look at that. We'll have to get the net for that dude. No, it's not, it's a bluefish. Don't, don't lift him up. Don't lift him up? Uh, get him, girl. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Yep, I just had one cut me off and Candace caught hers. Yeah. Now we'll get the net and we'll take a look at him. You look up at me. All right, there's Miss Candace's bluefish. Look at it, turn his mouth towards me. You can see he ate that old jig. They got a mouthful of teeth, these guys. They're, uh, they fight hard. They're one of the more hard fighting fish we have in Sarasota Bay. Cool. Old Spanish mackerel feeding off a new pass in Sarasota. We're throwing rappelas at them and catching them up. Stop, 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 stop. It looks like a big pinfish, Dad. Mackerel there. Mackerel there. Dolphins all around us trying to eat the mackerel. <laughs> Crazy. Lots of fish. Ryan's got him one up there. Oh, that's a pretty nice one. Be careful with it lower. Look at me and smile. Be on the video. Oh, there we go. Oh. Callan's got one. I'd say if you can't catch a fish here, you need to take up golf or badminton or something right this is crazy crazy nice and bent if you've never been out here this is what they call a fishing frenzy <laughs> the little guy for all that noise yeah it's all right fish everywhere which way to cast hard to know there he is. get him right I'm gonna, I'm gonna predict a strike right here. <laughs> I think, yeah, there yeah. he is. <laughs> oh, he come uh, off. We have lots of enemies on our side. Oh, he right? took the three. Oh, yeah. he caught it right off. Hey. Come on, bud. We're out here in Phillippe Creek, and I think we got a Jack Ravel on. We caught one a few minutes ago. Tide's going out. It's the morning. What you got? There he is. Another jack. Jack attack. That's a nice size. One. <laughs> there we go. Pull him up over this way if you can. Don't go in the boat. There he is. Very nice. Hey. Got the line above his head. All right, nice Jack Ravel. Let's go ahead and uh, release him on this side. There he 
There he goes. Yay. Another ladyfish on. Oh, getting a brand. Fish on. They're biting pretty good. <laughs> there he is, fish on. We're throwing these little lead head jigs with a grub on it. Just a matter of throwing it out, bouncing it around, and catching a couple fish at a time. It's first thing in the morning, which is usually best. Whoop, Alan's got him another one. We're catching ladyfish in New Pass. Fish are boiling everywhere. It's pretty much a bite on every cast. There's some. Oh, there we go. <laughs> we may actually land one, but it doesn't matter. It's a little frenzy out here. We got fish popping all over the place. I know. I got a fish. Jack's got a dock. Or Doc's got a jack. Their fish are popping everywhere. Doom, doom, doom. All right, let's catch him up. Hold him up real quick. All right, Jack Ravel, Jack Attack in Sarasota Bay. All right, we're out here fishing. Oh, real, 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 real. There we go. We're out here fishing in these rocks, which is perfect sheep's head habitat. And yes, indeed. What do you got? Nice fat sheep's head. Perfect. There you go. Hold him up a little bit for everybody to see. That beautiful fish. It is. Look at the crazy mouth on those dudes. They got some teeth. Some snaggle tooth. Yeah, they use those big teeth just to chew on the barnacles and get the crabs and shrimp and stuff inside. All right, perfect. Aish. Real, real, I think you got a bite, yep. Oh man, that could be a better one. Got another fish in the rocks here. Oh, nice one. Not huge, but big enough. Cool. Turn it sideways for us. There you go. Nice little sheep's head. All right, there he is. Pretty girl with a pretty sheep head. That's about the perfect, really eaten size, kind of average. Pound and three quarters, maybe two pounds. All righty. Very nice. All right, Buffy's got one on. Sitting in the same spot. Like I say, perfect sheep head habitat. It's about 25 feet deep right here. Ooh, nice one. Ooh, nice one. Might be the biggest one. Oh. We are out here in the Gulf of Mexico trolling for kingfish. It is mid-March and there's a few of them around. Dana's got one on now. We can't hardly get a line set. Four the planers are tripping. We're trolling number one and number two planers with some decent sized spoons and we are whacking them. Front's coming and uh, fish are chewing. Good video. Is it running right now? Yep. Yeah. Oof. Another little schooly kingfish. These things are fun when these little rods we're using. Here we go. See you, buddy. Oh, oh. There you go. Great job. Nice. Woohoo! So what we're doing is drifting the grass flats and casting the jig out ahead of the boat. This is really easy. Just toss it out, let it sink a few seconds, and then use short little twitches like Candace is doing to bring it back to the boat. Most of the time the fish hits it when it falls, and you just reel fast and come tight on them. This is a really effective technique for trout, ladyfish, bluefish, mackerel, really pretty much everything that swims in Sarasota Bay. 
got another fish on. It's staying deep. It's probably another catfish. We were just catching ladyfish, so I don't know where those guys went. This one's got some attitude. But they're fun. Now that's oh, a gaff. That's big a big one. Yeah, that's a gaff top sail catfish. Now if you notice the, uh, let me get left him up here. You notice those big dorsal fins and caudal fins. These are actually pretty good eating if you want to mess with them, but we're not going to. All right, there he is. Pretty little speckled trout. Um, those little grubs, jig and grub combos work fantastic for these guys. They use them all up and down the Gulf Coast of Florida, Alabama, Louisiana. They catch everything. They're easy to use. A lot of fun fishing. All right, Miss Candace. Finally got one in the boat. Lady with a ladyfish. You can see they eat those little jigs. They like that nice, fast, erratic action. These things are really a lot of fun. They're great fish to practice on. They pull hard. Just not good to eat, but that's okay. All right, we're gonna get this one off and let her go. All right, pretty little speckled trout. Pretty girl with a pretty trout. These things are, are pretty fish. It's kind of a smallish average size one. But they're bouncing back pretty good after the red tide last year. So we'll get her back in the water. Cool. Out here near a canal in Siesta Key, and Johnny's got him a nice snook on. We're throwing pilchards up against the mangrove shoreline. I think it's a pretty decent fish, I think. Oh, yeah, real yeah. Oh, that's a real nice fish. Watch this one that way. Holy cow. Real nice fish. All right, let me get, get me, there you go. Nice snook. Time to let her go. Or him. Thumb, right? Just wiggle your hand off, go. There you go. See ya, buddy. Doc's got him a snook. We have found us a little pile of them here on this dock, and we are whacking them. I won't say it's every cast, but it's not far from it. That's a nice snook for John. Nice jump. This was a leaper. We have found us a wad of them at this little dock here. That's not a bad one. Nope. Nice Sticky average size, long, yeah. Alrighty, we're out here river fishing with Bonnie on the Braden River. There's a school of fish popping up. Go ahead and throw in them, see if we can catch one. They're probably Jack Crevel. They're popping pretty good. Oh, there's a big something. Okay, get in there. No. Hard jerks. Be, be aggressive. These might be ladyfish. He's on it. All right, rod up. Take your time. And a girl. Nice and easy. Oh yeah, that's a big jack. Jack Ravel, hard fighting dudes. Yay. These things, what they do is they come up in here in the winter time in these creeks and canals and stuff. Oh yeah, if I had someone else, I'd be doubled up. Yeah, nice ones. Big size. This one's a big one. Oh yeah, good one. Yep, Jack Crevel. Oh, they're on the right side too. Yep, bit. yep, yep. Still fighting them. Fine, he's got a pretty good sized jack on. It's getting close though, so stop reeling. Just lift with the rod and lower the rod and reel. Lower fast and reel. That's it, let the rod do the work. Should be at the point. There he is up on the top. Oh man, that is a nice one. It's a big one, I think. Yeah, yeah that is a nice one. I haven't caught one this big in a while. Long one. That is a hooter, isn't it? He's a good size. Bigger than I thought. Bigger than I thought, too. Yeah, I saw him come up. I'm like, he's freaking big. I don't know what's average, so I'm like... I yeah, well, I'm going to have to put the camera down and get the old net here. Alright, well, let's get him in the boat. Stop reeling. Just lift him up. Well, or like don't lift him up, but no, no, that's good. Nice. Oh, that's awesome. All right, I had to stop filming the net at four, but big old Jack Creval. There you go. Lift it up just a little. Pretty fish. Yay. All right, let's get it back in the water. All right, Miss Candace has another one. This one's a ladyfish. We saw it jump. Oh. Take him up that way. 
<laughs> These things are fun. Oh, that's all right. He let go. Jack Ravel. Not a snook, but that's okay. Watch the ankle line. Right. Right. There you go. Come over here, Kim. There we go. Woo! <laughs> Come on back here. He really. That's a nice one. Yeah. <laughs> Dang, that one really gave me a workout. Okay. <laughs> Put this down. Woo! Okay. Look at that big boy. There we go. Am I gonna get to hold him? Yeah. Put your hand underneath. Watch, watch the ribby part yep. there. <laughs> Which way am I going? Look at me and smile. We have a monster snook on. We're on the Mayaka River. He's jumped what, three, four times? Yeah. He's really big. Oh my gosh. You're not happy. Holy shit, it can't even fit it in the net. That'll yeah. work, huh? <laughs> All right. Got a fish on. I think this time it is a snook. We're throwing little pilchers up again. Oh, leave him in the water. Leave him in the water. Leave him in the water. That's a nice one. Bring him over this way. Don't lift it up. Bring him to me, sweetie. There we go. Now we're talking. Kansas got a fish on this time. You know what it is? Uh, no. Hasn't jumped, so it's probably oh, a jack. A oh, it is a little snug. Oh, there we go. Nice. A little, little snooklet. We've caught a half dozen of these guys, one decent one and a few little ones, but they're fun. Nice. <laughs> 